Hey everyone, here's a question from exercise 10.16 question. This is from algebraic expression of class 7 and this question is based on like and unlike terms. So the question is state whether the given pair of term is a like or unlike. So like terms are the one uh, which have a same algebraic factors and unlike term means if the algebraic factors are not same they are called unlike terms. Now when you're doing this you have to keep in mind that we should not consider numerical coefficient. We don't consider numerical coefficient and the order the way they are present. But we have to check the power of the uh, algebraic factor which is present. I'm going to explain you how. So first question you can see we have 1 and 100. So 1 and 100 both are like they are constant. They are numbers right. So we can say yes they are like terms. And the second one. Uh, second one you can see we have minus 7 x and 5 by 2 x. So minus 7 and 5 by 2 they are numerical coefficient. We should not consider that. We have to check the variable part. We have x and here also x and there is no other variable apart from x. So we can say yes it is also a like term. The next one. So we have minus 29 x and minus 29 y. So though the numerical coefficient is same but the variable part these algebraic uh, algebraic factors we have to consider right. If you see that they are not same. One is x and one is y. So we can say that they are unlike terms. So we, do, we should not consider the numerical uh, coefficient. We should take only the variable part. See if the variables are same or not. Or if they are same check the powers also. Then the next question fourth one. So we have 14xy and 42yx. So we should don't consider 14 and 14 and 42. Just check the variable. We have x here. Here also we have x. We have y here. Here also we have y. So though the order is different, but we can still consider it. So this is a like terms. The next one, fifth one. It's 4m square p and 4m p square. Though we have a variable m and p here also m and p. Just check the power m square there are two m's present here but here there's only one m present there's only one p present here in second term there are p square two p's are present so they are unlike terms so the power also we should consider when you're checking it so they are unlike terms then the last question so we have 12 xz and 12 x square z square though xz are the variable in the first term in second term there is x square and z square x and z are present but look at the power second term it's square in the first term is only power is one so which means they are unlike terms so that's it i hope it's clear when you're doing how to check the like and unlike terms we have to we should not consider numerical coefficient when you're comparing them check the algebraic factor that is a variable part you should check if the variable is present and then check the powers if they are present they are equal or not so i hope this question is clear in case you have further question or doubt you can drop a comment thank you so much for watching